to where they, uh, <clears throat> since we're just going to flush everything, there's no reason to flush one way and then flush the other. We're just, so right now, if you look at the side of that thing, the T is like this, okay, which means water can't come in. Yeah. That's where you got your hose hooked up. So what we're going to do is flip it and it's going to be like that. So the water can come in and go up and down. Okay. All right. So both sides of those, yeah, you'll need a, a ratchet for that. Uh, okay. You don't have any paper towel? I'm all out of paper towel. I can grab some this morning. I forgot. I used a lot of mine yesterday. The worst of air back and it'll blow out and bust the light bulbs. You could catch fire and things like that. So always start up with it just barely open so that you can get some feed. <laughs> Go 
Yeah, you're gonna break a pro wall. You always use the same one. Mm -hmm. That way, calibration, you're not worried about any kind of difference. It's pretty good loop. It stays in the woods. It's good loop. That's 49, right? About 48. Yeah. After hearing it run the whole time we were here, mm -hmm. the door opened over here and all that. Yeah. Second 
last age, you'll get you about six. Hey Jeff, in what situation would you want to isolate and flush just the loops or just the geo itself when versus you, flushing the whole system? When you do the, when you originally start up. Okay. You know, your loop installer flushes them individually. Mm -hmm. And then at the end they flush them all at once. Okay. You know, and you do that to get the air out of them independently. Okay. We had the air out of them independently. Sure. We just wanted to flush the whole thing. Okay, so really, aside from new installation, there's really no time where we'd ever want to isolate them. Um, if you're just changing out a pump, mm -hmm. you're basically just going to shut the loop off outside, mm -hmm. replace the pump, put two garden hoses in there as your fittings, mm -hmm. and then pump water from <clears throat> one garden hose through the unit. When you see the air coming out the other and you're done, and it's just good solid water, then shut the discharge off just like we did here, and then shut... The, you then open up that discharge side and then you're still water is still pressurizing now the whole loop and then you shut that valve off and then you go shut the water off okay and that's the changing the pump out with uh, with just a couple garden hoses cool and uh, and that's in the flow center manuals there are five-step instructions in there to follow okay to help you with that cool thanks